Good morning and welcome back to Summit Sunrise. I am joined with my friend Lindsay from the town of Frisco. Good morning and welcome. Good morning. Thank you for joining me. Yes, thanks for having me. Oh, it's always nice to have company here on, on you know, I feel like, sometimes I feel like I'm talking to myself sometimes because, I'm sure. you know, it, like Lauren always gets to, to go to all the fun spots over in Breckenridge and then here I am talking to myself. And you are stuck here in the studio. <laughs> oh yeah, it's a rough life. I know. What. <laughs> well, Lindsay, you do phenomenal things over in Frisco with all of the events and there's always, always something going on for everybody. You guys have everyone in the entire family covered. Yes, we do. We try to, like you said, kids, parents, everybody get them over to Frisco to have some fun. And we do, our summer's kind of winding down. The kids start school in a couple weeks, which is hard to believe. Um, but we do, we have one more event that kind of wraps up summer mm -hmm. and that's Run the Rockies Trail Half Marathon and 10K. Whoa, Half Marathon and 10K. So yes. that has everybody covered. Here, here it is right here. And yes. that is on August 15th. Correct, yep. So the Half Marathon starts at 8 a.m. Okay. And the 10K starts at 8.30. Okay. Um, so it's it's all trail. Mm -hmm. We're out at the Frisco Peninsula Recreation oh, Area. Oh, beautiful. So it's great and there are, I mean, people said last year it was one of the most beautiful courses they've run. Beautiful views of Lake Dillon, Peak One, Buffalo. Um, Just the full 360 great. degrees. Yes. Well, that, oh, I can imagine, um, that location is really perfect for running. I mean, th there are some photos of it right there. Yes. Um, but it's, I mean, I, I take the dog and go for a walk just on that because it's so beautiful. It's like completely serene and it's just, it's really, really nice. It is, and the dogs can get in the water if they want to. They can, there. I know, and they can get a little drink, so yes. you don't have to worry about that, which is always convenient. Yes. Um, so what can they expect for the train? I mean, is it mostly flat? Because it can be a little bit hilly over there. Yeah, sure, great question. So. Mm -hmm. It's, um, it's, we have an actual profile, the okay. um, topo map online. If people want to oh. check it out, they can go to our website so Perfect. they can see that. Okay. Um, otherwise, there are a couple of hills surprisingly up there on the Peninsula Recreation Area. Okay. Um, but I'd say it's, you know, beginner to intermediate terrain. There's no crazy hill climbs. Okay. Um, but the terrain is, is kind of rolly up there, which is why it's good for cross-country skiing over the winter. Right, of course. So um, for folks that maybe haven't done a 10K, before um, and they're thinking about like you know this is a great way to kind of build up especially I feel like it's always such a challenge um, because we are at such high elevation yes. here so oh and there's the there's the map so folks can see yes. kind of what they're getting themselves into that is super helpful yep you can see it right there so mm -hmm. you know and it starts out relatively flat we kind of start through the Frisco disc golf course a little okay. bit mm -hmm. and then we run on the perimeter trail mm -hmm. so it does it is an easy start for both the 10k and the half marathon right um, and I mean, I'd say we had a lot of beginner trail racers. A lot of people aren't used to running on the trails, and everybody enjoyed it last year. You just have to watch your footing. Right, of um, course. Yeah, and just, you know, pace yourself out there. Okay, well, that, that is wonderful. What about the rest of the family? Yeah, so great. So we have Frisco Free Family Fun Fair. Say that 10 times fast. Tongue twister. We <laughs> have that on August 15th as well from 10 to 3. Okay. And that's going to be taking place on the Great Lawn, mm -hmm. which is right outside of the Frisco Day Lodge. Perfect. Oh, and that's beautiful right there. Yes. And so what we have there, it's free family activities, mm -hmm. um, you know, mostly aimed at for the kids. Sure. Um, everything from bounce houses to a climbing wall. Um, I think we might have those Zorb balls out there again. They'll be face painting. Cool. There's a magician. So all these free things taking place. I was place. going to say, and it's really cool because this is all free. Yes, it's all free. We always encourage people to bring, there's going to be a couple of vendors there if you want to sure. buy some food or drinks. Uh -huh, but uh -huh. um, yes, everything's free. They can come out and just you know, enjoy the day. How nice is that? That's perfect. Yes. Um, and also too, we should mention this evening, there is a free concert. Yes. Over at the Historic Park right on Main Street and that starts at 5.30. It's 5.30 to 7.30. You can see there's yep. um, a little clip of what it looks like and it's, it's gonna be a perfect day for that. So if folks are looking for something to do right now, as in today. Today, yes. <laughs> there is the free concert that is at 5.30 this evening. Folks, you don't want to miss out on that. It's a lot of fun over there. And for more fun. information on the Run the Rockies and the Frisco Free, free Family, family fun, fun Fair. Fair. <laughs> yes. Yep, you can just go to townoffrisco.com and there it'll direct you to whatever event you're looking for. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for coming in and chatting yes, all things you. Frisco, free, family, and fun. Yes. <laughs> it's always a pleasure to have you, Lindsay. Good to see you. Thank you for joining me. Thanks. Great to see you, too. And folks, make sure that you check out townoffrisco.com for more information on Run the Rockies and this evening's free concert at 530. We'll be right back with more Summit Sunrise right after this.